in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up sandbox feature that offered by Windows 10. This feature is offered on uh, version 1903 and higher. And to find out what kind of version you have, you need to click on start, click on settings, click on system, scroll down, click on about and scroll down. And if you have 1903 or higher, then this feature is going to be available. So to do that, you need to click on start, type control panel and open control panel and control panel. You need to click on programs and features. And this window, click on turn windows features on or off. And this pop-up box, scroll down and you'll see windows sandbox. Put a check mark right next to it and then click OK. And it's going to start searching for uh, Windows either updates or feature files. Once it's done applying all the files, you need to restart your computer. I'm going to restart now. Once your computer restarted, you need to click on start and type sandbox. And right here, you'll see Windows sandbox. You click on it. And it's going to load new session of Windows 10, but it's going to be in a sandbox. So right here, you can do all of your testing. You can test malware, viruses, or any new software that you're not sure of if they're affected or not. And you can do anything that you need to do in the sandbox. So that's pretty much it. Feature that comes with uh, Windows 10. Also, to do that, you have to make sure that your uh, virtualization in BIOS is enabled. If it's not, then you're not going to be able to enable this feature. And uh, to find out if it's enabled or not, what you need to do, you need to restart your computer. And on the startup, you need to open BIOS. So let's do this really quick. I'm going to shut down Sandbox. And I'm going to restart my computer and I'm going to load into the BIOS. On a startup, enter into the BIOS. On my Lenovo, I had to press enter and then F1 on your computer. It could be F2 or escape or something else. So in here in the BIOS, what you need to do, you need to go into security and uh, go down to virtualization and then click enter and make sure it's enabled here, virtualization technology and VTD feature. If it's not enabled, make sure you enable it and then go back and then uh, restart and then click on uh, exit saving changes and it's going to restart your computer and it's going to save all the changes you made and it's going to let you enable sandbox in the feature in Windows 10. Thanks for watching.